check out the State Farm starting lineups. First for the Thunder, the backcourt comprised of Russell Westbrook and Tabo Sefalosha. Holding down the pivot of physical and bruising big man at 6'10. Big Perk, Kendrick Perkins. And it's Durant. And it's Ibaka in at the four slot. And for the Suns, Dragic and Dudley are the backwards end. And at center, it's Marcin Gortat, the 6'11 versatile scorer and finisher known as the Polish Hammer. Then there's Beasley. And it's Skola in at the four. Westbrook gets to Durant. Well, Michael Beasley was a power forward at the college level, but he's been a little bit of an in-betweener in the pros. Uh, most teams have tried to play him at the small forward uh, because he's got that shooting ability, but he, he has a hard time guarding other three men. So it's uh, it's a little bit of a mismatch at both ends of the floor with Beasley. So it's the Thunder now. After the Suns pick up two, Perkins dishes to Durant. Perkins with the screen for Durant. Perkins against Gortat. Durant kicks to Cephalosha. Back to Durant. Second chance shot. And that's two points on the layup. And Clark, when you talk about recognizing that mismatch, when you had a smaller guy guarding you, you know, what, what was what was your mind doing? What were your eyes? What were you doing? Well, you were just feeling the fact that you had an opportunity to take advantage of a guy that couldn't deal with you. So take your time. No rush. Get it where you want it, and then go to work. That's playing. Wow. Oh, so yeah. athletic play. Incredible. Wow. Well, after he threw that one down, he felt free to hang around for a little while. A little extra emphasis at the end. Now, you got to be careful, too, on that. It uh, used to be an automatic technical foul. They'll still call it at times, but they're a little more selective with the call. Special thanks to Sprite for that sweet replay. Pass to Dudley. Now the feed to Dragic. Just five to shoot. Passes it to Dudley. Over Cephalosha. Dudley, no luck. Very porous defense down there by the hoop. He probably should make that one. Well, with such a young core and showing that they can be a, a team that can hold their own in the tough Western Conference, it's possible we could be looking at a, a decade-long run here with the Thunder, where they win multiple conference championships and maybe NBA titles as well. And a little over two and a half minutes gone here in the first. Here's Krajic. Great D that time from Westbrook. The Thunder leading by four. See, that's a good thought. You certainly have to think so, the way they are dominating their division and the rest of the West the past few years. But what a solid young core they have to go with. Yeah, they're fantastic, Kevin. Such a young team. They've been knocking on the door for a championship the last couple of years, and they should be a contender as long as they can keep this core together and stay healthy. Krajic kicks to Skola. To end the run. The pass to Dudley. Rebounded by Serge Ibaka. I'll tell you what, folks. I bet he won't miss that shot next time he takes it. Left side, Ibaka. Gives him the lead pass. Durant, the pass to Ibaka. Outside, Westbrook. Kicks it to Zephalosha. And it's good with time running down on the shot clock. Cephalosha's got his second basket. And they're going to need more possessions like that one to try to extend this lead. And if they have possessions like that, guys, uh, they'll continue to add to their margin and keep that pace going brisk. If you look at Suns coach Alvin Gentry, has over 30 years of NBA coaching experience and over a decade as a head coach. Last year with the Suns, he tallied his 300th coaching victory. Back to Scola, over Ibaka, and Luis Scola, the bucket, and he answers by Trogic. That mid-range jumper, just another one of his weapons. Let's go to Doris Burke, who spoke with head coach Alvin Gentry. I asked him what he thought would be the key for them, and he told me dealing with the penetration of Russell Westbrook. He's one of the most explosive athletes in the game. We've got to send him to help and rotate early to deny him finishes at the rim. Guys, that's never easy. Great. Thanks for the report, Doris. 
Here's Dragic. He's covered by Westbrook. Dudley dishes to Scola over Ibaka. Ibaka with some nice D. And Alvin Gentry in Phoenix for six years as an assistant, so he was a natural to take over the head coaching reins and continue their up-tempo offensive system. Yeah, and he did a terrific job. And, uh, you know, he, he's got a, a, a great way of communicating to his players. He's a very funny guy. Uh, you know, players love him. But he can also be tough when he establishes the right tone. And now the big challenge is to do so without Steve Nash. You know, now it's time to you know, run this offense without Nash. Major challenge for Gentry. Durant kicks to Perkins. Back to Durant. Oklahoma City moving the ball around. Westbrook passes to Ibaka. Score on him. Up with it. And again, Serge Ibaka. Ibaka's got six points. And all 10 of their last points have come inside the paint. So defensively, you've got to make an adjustment. Yeah, and you got to do a little more to stop it, too. I mean, it's coming way too easy for them. At some points, you just got to buck up and say it's not going to happen. Here's Gortat. Rises up and throws it down. The defense just couldn't recover in time. Yeah, the defense pretty much went brain neutral on that one part. Wouldn't, wouldn't yes, you? sir. I like that phrase. Yeah, I don't use that phrase very often, but to me, that's what happened. He uh, shifted the, the brain into neutral. Yes, <laughs> that was embarrassing. <laughs> and it's good. Right now, it's all working for him here in the first. The shots have been falling. Yeah, their offense has been very impressive. If they keep this up, Mark, they're going to be tough to beat. And the Suns here with a different look. Channing Fries checked in for Gortat. Johnson comes in for Luis Stoller. Shannon Brown, he's checked in for Jared Dudley. And it's Telfer in for Goran Dragic. And then for Oklahoma City, Allison comes in for Kendrick Perkins. And it's Harden in for Tavo Cephalosha. That's how you exploit that defense. Take the ball right to the basket. The Thunder leading by 10. Shannon Brown is one of those guys who... When he gets in transition, you kind of hold your breath because you can't wait to see what's coming. He can absolutely fly. He's a guy who's on the highlight reel night after night. You know what I love about Durant, uh, Kevin, is the fact that he can be cruising along and then all of a sudden he'll just kick it into high gear. You know, he gets his points quietly at times because it comes so effortlessly. Uh, but when the game's on the line, he can get hot and just bury you. Steve, if you were just going to dream up a score, a machine-like, video game-like score, KD, Kevin Durant, is what you would come up with. Long, lean, can shoot a deep ball skills, and the attitude and aggressiveness of a late-game closer. Jared Dudley's checked in for Phoenix. Rogic comes in for Sebastian Telford. Then for the Thunder, Jones checked in for Ibaka. And it's Maynard in for Russell Westbrook. Here's Durant, buried from 15 feet out. Durant's got 12. And Shannon Brown, fellas, at 6'4", 210, powerfully built, athletic player. I mean, big, strong hands. And the one thing that I felt he needed to do was improve his ball handling, because if he did that, I really thought he could be an explosive scorer around the rim and on the perimeter. Dragic gets the bucket. 23 seconds left in the first quarter of the game. Now Maynard, outside Durant. Durant off a pick from Jones. Durant kicks to Maynard. Collison up top. Harden outside. Got it. Good job in the low post. Harden's got his first points of the game. What a start they've gotten off to. A big lead for them, and we're not even out of the first quarter yet. And it's